Hi, I'm Oscar. And I'm Scott. And together we are the Ginfluencers UK. <laughs> Whoa, boy. <laughs> The gin we're trying today is Glasgow gin. What's so funny? Your cone on your head. Anyway. <laughs> there was a very famous image of a cone on the head of the Duke of Wellington statue in Glasgow. The image epitomises exactly what Glasgow is. Fun, lively, different and cheeky. Glasgow gin is distilled to a special recipe in the heart of the city and it's a proud tribute to the people who inspired it. Now, what's in it? Juniper berries? Yeah. Coriander seed? Yeah. Angelica root, <laughs> lemon and orange peel, cassia and cinnamon bark, ground nutmeg, orris root and elderflowers. Do we need to get you a glove puppet? <laughs> it comes in a 70 centilitre bottle with an ABV of 43.3% ABV of and we paid about £33 for that. We're going to make a classic G&T using premium tonic water and a twist of lime. We're also going to make one of their recommended cocktails, which is called a Gallus Bird. Mm -hmm. Birds always would be trying it neat first. Really? Would you mind sticking that I, in the stable? I, I will. Yeah, thank you very much. <laughs> Hold on, I've got to do one. <laughs> no, no budget spared. Yeah. No budget spared. Right, let's get out over there. No there horses you. were harmed in this <laughs> making of this video. Right. Oh. Boop. There we go. Why have we got two bottles? Um, this is the newer bottle, that's the older bottle, so I just wanted both. I actually prefer that looking bottle. Wow, don't think they care. <laughs> <laughs> oh, it's crisp. It's very crisp. <laughs> what? They don't care. No, they don't they care don't. what you think, are you? Oh, wow. Oh, that's really crisp. It smells crisp and it tastes crisp. Yeah. Uh, you're getting a lot of sweetness. I'm getting quite a bit of sweetness there. Yeah, but it's it is... It's quite floral. It is. It's quite... It's quite fruity. Yeah, it's fruity. Yeah, and it's kind of more citrus kind of fruits, apples, those kind of more slightly acidic yeah. sweet fruits. Yeah, absolutely. It's I like actually, it though. Yeah, it's, yeah, it's, it's quite nice. enjoyable. It's really... It's, it's actually quite nice and neat. Yeah, it is. I think it's drinkable neat. It really is. It's got, it's got one of those tastes at the back where... It, it's a little bit licorice -y. It tails off, thinking, yeah. licorice -y. yeah. Yeah. It's very pleasant though. Okay, so let's, there you let's go. stick it in a tonic. So, cheers. Cheers, Oscar. Cheers. Give it a stir. We can take it out. Wow. Wow, it's very, it's very different. Changed. Yeah, really, really changed. Very different. Yeah. It's still nice and crisp. I'm, the, the sweetness is, isn't, as, isn't as intense, but I actually prefer it this way. No, but it is, I still think it's a quite a sweet gin. This has elements it is, it is sweet, but of an old it's not tom. As intense, yeah, yeah, it has elements of an old tom for me. Um, wow, mm. yeah, it's, uh, it's zesty. Um, it's still f slightly fruity and slightly floral. Yeah, very non-offensive. Mm. Nice, easy drinker. Very easy, I was just about to say, mm. very drinkable. Very, very drinkable. I love it when you say a gin's drinkable because the idea is that you drink it. So if it was undrinkable, we have had we have, we had, had a couple that are undrinkable, yeah, Scott. Undrinkable. Right? All and right. You may have seen that in some of our videos. <laughs> um, what do you know? What I get from this, you know, sometimes I say it's a summer gin or it's a winter. Yeah. This is an all rounder. This is a real. It rounder. is an all rounder, and yes, I, I've said this a couple of times. I could probably finish that quite easily mm. in the next couple of minutes. Right. <laughs> this is this it's going down a little bit yeah, too easy. It's really yeah. easy to go down. But yeah, I'm I'm really really enjoying it. The juniper is really is really light. It's not heavy yeah, it's, on juniper. It, it's not oily. Very juniper. light. It's just there. It's just right. Yeah. I it, think this this is a gin for someone. You know those people that go. I'm 
not a lover of gin. I think they'd like this one because it has those kind of sweet elements. But in. then true gin, gin drinkers we'll will, also, like will also like yeah. this. Um, yeah, yeah, I mean, every, everyone knows I, I'm a real London dry type of person. Um, and this is, I mean, I do like fr fruitier flavours as well every now hmm. and then. You like it fruity? <laughs> <laughs> this, is, this is ticking a lot of boxes for me. Yeah, it is for me. Right, I'm going to crack on with the cocktail because they recommend a few cocktails oh, on yeah, their website. Forgot about that. You forgot about that, didn't you? Right, so I'm going to do that. Can you stick some ice in there oh. for me? Not too much, but just a bit. There um, you go. So, we are doing a Gallus Bird. So what you're going to need is, obviously, their gin, some elderflower cordial, and some cranberry juice. So once once he's done that, come on. In, I was trying to do yeah. it as noisily as possible. Thank you. Thank you very much. Right, there we go. So the ratios that they recommend are 50 mil of this. So I, now I'm obviously doubling up because there's two of us. I mean, you can you can put him away. Um, so I'm doubling up because there is two of us. So there's a 50 and a 50, and then it's recommended 25 of this and I believe 50 of this. Yeah, 50 of yeah. cranberry. Yeah. yeah. Okay, so that, that'd be 100. So let's lock the pot out of the way. Can you stop that? Because it's really putting me off. Really? Yeah. Don't, uh, don't irritate me. We're That's really hard not to. It's really hard not to. Right, so we're going to go 50 of this, and then obviously I'll pop that there so people can see. I'm, listen, I'm, I'm not a mixologist, I'm not a barman, so I'm really rubbish at things like this, so I hope you don't kind of... Judge us. Judge, judge us too barman. much. Yeah, we're not barmen. We're people who like gin. We're people who like drinking. There you go, that's us. Right, there we go. There you, go. you did mathematics correctly there. I did, I was struggling a little bit, that's why you, seem, you could almost see the workings going on in my head. Right, we'll put this little thing on. Ooh, there right, you there go. we go. I look almost professional. Really cold, really, really cold. If you can hear me. <laughs> wow, that looks really, really cold. Right, okay. So get the glasses ready. Yep. So we're gonna go. Oh, what a beautiful little colour. Do you wanna put the lime in? Oh, I've forgotten about the lime. You had one job. One job. One job. There we go. <laughs> Stick that over there. <laughs> right, let's give this a go. You ready? Yep. Cheers. Cheers. Wow. <laughs> yeah, wow. that's lovely. Now I like cocktails. That's brilliant. <laughs> that's really good. That's really, obviously with the cranberry and the old flat, that's really fruity. It's really sweet. Um, we're supposed to put it in martini glass. You did glass. put the gin in there, didn't I you? I did put the gin in there. <laughs> you, wouldn't, you wouldn't know if you gin wouldn't know. In there. Yeah, you wouldn't know. Um, but yeah, I'm, I'm really, yeah, I love this. I could, I could do a jug of this. Yeah, I could do a jug of this. You, you know, Not that I'm encouraging drink. No, no, please drink responsibly. Um, wow. It's fantastic. It's really, really lovely. Wow. Um, more for me, that's more of an evening cocktail, though. For some reason, I don't know what. Maybe because it's so, so sweet, you maybe wouldn't want it in the heat and stuff. But they do. They've got a long list, so I think we'd be experimenting. Oof. I'm really loving that. Right, yes, let's, let's, let's judge it. This. Let's judge it. Obviously, we're going on the gin and tonic. We'll be doing it on the gin and tonic. Um, right. Okay. Are, are you done? Right. Come on. I am. Right. Go. An easy 10 for me. Wow. Easy okay. 10. Okay, yeah, nine from me. I mean, nine's a brilliant score. The thing is, right, so with our scoring, um, with some of our scores have been kind of low for certain things. If it's five, it's all right. It's an all right gin. Five and above, it's a really good gin. Below five, yeah, it needs work. Um, and that's how it goes. It but yeah, I mean, I really love this. This yeah. will always be on our shelves. Absolutely. I can't wait to try the other cocktails. They, yeah. they, see, they seem, like, you know, this seems, Amazing, I love it, I absolutely love it. Do right. You, do you want some? No. <laughs> <laughs> so, don't forget to like and subscribe. Right, and we'll just play us out. We'll see you in the next video. Cheers. Cheers. <laughs>